Hello everyone. Um, I'm just going to talk you through how to create a uh, DMG installer file. And um, before we get on, you may hear some noise in the background. That's my dog uh, pacing around. So if we go to um, Applications, Utilities, and then the uh, Disk Utility. Okay, we're going to go click on New Image. Uh, we'll call it something, so Test Image image. Leave all this stuff um, as is, we don't need to mess with that right now, if you want to look into that more then that's fine. So we'll create that, close the disk utility, um, double click on the test image and it comes up with this blank box like that right there. So right click, um, show view options, then you get these options here. So what we're going to do is we're going to change this to picture. Um, now I've already prepared one. We've got this logo small here. We're just going to drag that in here as you would a normal file. Now it's copied into this image. We're going to copy that over to there and it appears like that. But you've still got this ugly thing here. But we can deal with that. So if we're going to load the console change our path to uh, volumes ls and then you'll see that we've got the test image there so if we change to that um, and there's our image so what we're going to do is we're going to make that we're going to hide that image um, by giving it a dot on the name so we're going to rename that by typing mv um, logo small small dot png and then it's new file it's just going to be exactly the same but with a dot in front of it logo small rename that and you've seen that it's disappeared so we shrink this down here like that um, I'm not worrying too much about how this looks this is just um, just a quick and dirty example if you was going to do this properly then you'd do that you know you'd a nice image here and there'll be an arrow there because because of what we're going to do next um, right so the application that we're going to put in there is this test application that I did earlier with Xcode and um, you can do your own obviously now I made a bit of a schoolboy error here because the text is is in black so it's not hiding up there's probably a way to change that but I don't know what it is and, and for right now I don't really care so um, if you find the answer then, then let me know you can change the size of this icon here with this thing here now ordinarily when you see these things you get an option to drag over to your applications folder so what we're going to do is we're going we, to we're going to make an alias so a um, new finder window up get to our, um, our applications right click and then we're going to make an alias okay um, I've already made one of these clearly so let's go to the first one and then we're just going to drag that over like that so already you can you can feel what's going on here really this is this is um, just drag this over there so let's just close this down at the moment and then eject this okay um, Oh, sorry, terminal's using it. Let's get rid of that. Let's eject that. Let's open this um, in the dish utility. And now we're going to convert it. Okay, so um, that's the one we're going to convert. Convert. We get these options here. The option you want is compressed. Now there's read only and there's compressed. Well, Compressed is read only, but it compresses it too, so that's the option you want. So test image, spelt wrong, but you can spell it right. Let's save that, replace. Okay, and when that's done, let's close down dish utility. So what we end up with here now is uh, test image. When you double click on it, opens up. And then we get our 
installer. So drag your program over there into applications. Then when you go to applications, uh, we'll just do this way. Go to applications, our test thingy should be there. There it is, double click and test. Voila, easy.